Let me introduce to you ReZero. This little fella was developed by a group of 10 undergraduate students at the Autonomous Systems Laboratory at ETH Zurich. Our robot belongs to a family of robots called ballbots. Instead of wheels, a ballbot is balancing and moving on one single ball. The main characteristics of such a system is that there's one sole contact point to the ground. This means that the robot is inherently unstable. It's like when I'm trying to stand on one foot. You might ask yourself, what's the usefulness of a robot that's unstable? And I will explain that in a second. Let me first explain how ReZero actually keeps his balance. ReZero keeps his balance by constantly measuring his pitch angle with a sensor. He then counteracts and avoids toppling over by turning the motors appropriately. This happens 160 times per second, and if anything fails during this process, ReZero would immediately fall to the ground. Now, to move and to balance, ReZero needs to turn the ball. The ball is driven by three special wheels that allow ReZero to move into any direction and also move around his own axis at the same time. Due to his instability, ReZero is always in motion. Now, here's the trick. It's indeed exactly this instability that allows a robot to move very dynamic. Let's play a little. You might have wondered what happens if I give the robot a little push. In this mode, he's trying to maintain his position. For the next demo, I'd like you to introduce to my colleagues Michael on the computer and Thomas, who's helping me on stage. In the next mode, ReZero is passive and we can move him around. With almost no force, I can control his position and his velocity. We can also make him spin. In the next mode, we can get ReZero to follow a person. He's now keeping a constant distance to Thomas. This works with a laser sensor that's mounted on top of ReZero. With the same method, we can also get him to circle a person. We call this the orbiting mode. All right, thank you, Thomas. <laughs> now, what's the use of this technology? For now, it's an experiment, but let me show you some possible future applications. ReZero could be used in exhibitions or parks. With a screen, it could inform people or show them around in a fun and entertaining way. In a hospital, this device could be used to carry around medical equipment. Due to the Boltbot system, it has a very small footprint and it's also easy to move around. And of course, who wouldn't like to take a ride on one of these? <laughs> now, these are more practical applications but there's also a certain beauty within this technology.
Thank you. Thank you.